Here's how my typical day as Ryu Okada usually goes down. Hey, don't be so full of yourself, Mr. Big Shot. You might make a fool of yourself. <laughs> You're gonna be the ones making fools of yourselves. You and your little crew will regret coming to our school once I'm done with you. Who do you think you are, getting all arrogant like that? What did you just say? Seriously, you're the arrogant ones here. Don't think you can bail after messing up our school festival. <laughs> you're the reason for all this mess. <laughs> you messed it up by trying to hit on those girls when you're just not cool enough. Even the girls in my class were totally turned off by you. This is Kanna Miura. She's a rebellious girl who acts like a lone wolf. If you can't get girls, then take a hike. You're a total wuss. I had to bring these guys up to the school rooftop to dodge a classroom fight, but now it's just as much trouble up here. Why are all of you here? So, you went ahead and told the teacher, huh? That's pretty lame. Oh well, fine. We'll bounce from your school for now. Hey, wait a minute! Hey, Dio and Kana, you guys alright? Thank goodness our teacher arrived on time. Yeah, everything's cool. Just that Kanna had to get into the argument. You're the one who jumped into the argument. I was managing just fine without you. What can a girl like you handle by yourself? What did you just say now? I'll show you what I'm capable of. I'll totally crush you. I'm up for the challenge. Oh, come on. Don't start fighting now, guys. Dealing with troublemakers and arguing with the girls in class is what I deal with every day as the leader of my crew. Speaking of which, my second in command is... Ryu! Dude, I heard you got into it with those guys from the other school yesterday. Why didn't you hit us up? Because I was fine taking on the fight on my own. Honestly, I didn't want to make things worse than they already were. This is Kei Saito. He's quiet most of the time, but when he's in a fight, he's a whole different person. Ryu! Yeah? Thanks for yesterday. I thought you were intimidating, but you're actually really sweet, Ryu. You didn't even flinch when handling that tough crew. You're strong and cool. Hey, wanna give me your phone number? If that's cool with you. S sure. I don't know why, but all the girls are suddenly into me. Man, this is such a pain in the neck. <sighs> a few hours later. My crew keeps joking around and saying, Hey man, you're a hit with the girls. Seriously? I can't remember the last time I ate by myself. OMG, this is so adorable. Huh? What? Ryu? Why are you grinning like that? It's seriously creepy. I was just checking out a video of a cute little kitten. I was feeling happy looking at it. But then I saw your scary face and it ruined everything. Like... I have to have lunch with her, but I don't want to give up my spot, so I'll just stay and eat here. You shared your number with the girls, didn't you? How come you're not eating with them? Eh, I helped them out at the school festival, and they said they wanted to thank me, so we swapped numbers. But I doubt I'll reach out to them. It's gonna end up like middle school all over again. Of course, she's always on her own because of her attitude. I mean, if she's gonna keep bringing up middle school stuff, why is she still talking to me? Did she just move on from all that? Why aren't you eating with the girls too? Huh? The girls are into you, so why not eat with them in the classroom? Well, I think I'd rather have lunch with the girls in our class than with you. Look at you. Getting a big head because all the girls like you. Eating with you is ruining my lunch, seriously. Whoa, she's extra grumpy today, isn't she? What's up with you? I'm gonna beat you up for real! Ha! Huh, you're just bluffing! You'd never lay a hand on a girl like me! I know you better than anyone! Huh? What are you suddenly going on about? You're seriously itching to break free from your crew, aren't you? Oh, that's the topic you're on about, I see. So, me and Kanna were in the same middle school together. We were always trying to find our own space and avoid attention. And yeah, we've been arguing a bunch since then. Hey, we're graduating soon. You should hang out with the other girls during lunch. 
You can't keep acting like a lone wolf all the time. You can't just say that. I know girls won't eat lunch with me, and you know it too. Uh, hey, if you're gonna shut yourself off and act all tough, don't go being a punk. I already told you, you can't just say that. Who are you to talk when you're the leader of your crew? I didn't choose to be the leader of my crew. What do you mean? My bro is a total rebel, and his crew even show me respect just because I'm his younger bro. Plus, I've got this mean face. I don't belong anywhere else except with my crew. Man, the punks I rolled with in elementary and middle school were real bad news. But they did let me be me, so there's that. But if I don't step in, they'll start messing with people who aren't even part of their own crew. That's why you... Yeah, I'm the leader of my crew by default because I'm the only one willing to deal with those troublemakers. Why not just leave your crew if you want out? Are the crew members you're with really that bad? Will they start problems if you're not around to stop them? Things aren't the same as they were when I was in middle school. The leader of the crew at the other school we're clashing with is straight up crazy. If I step down as leader, things will get messy for sure. Who knows how many people will get hurt? Do you... you know... Oh, there you are! Oh, I get it now. So, that's why you weren't into the other girls in class, huh? Uh, my bad for interrupting. <laughs> that's total crap! Why would I like a girl like her? Hold up. What was that? Who do you think you are? You're super close with each other. After school that day... Took you long enough to show up. Well, at least you're on your own. Huh? Oh, what do you want? You want to quit beefing with the crew from the other school, right? Just tag along with me. Hey! Quit beefing? What's she going on about? The spot where Kanna took me to was... What were you even thinking, Kanna? As leaders of your crews, you should just talk it out. Don't do anything dumb and start any gang brawls like punks had back in the day. Hey, are you familiar with this guy? He was the one who wouldn't leave me alone and sneaked my number into his phone, telling me to get in touch. So, is that leader there really gonna chat with me about this? Yeah, alright. We're having a top secret discussion in an old building. I'm not sure what's going on, but if this is how we're gonna end the beef between our crews, then... So, we spent an hour discussing it, but... I don't even get any satisfaction from your apologies. So my ideas didn't really get across to him, huh? It's surprising we haven't started fighting yet. Even better, why not just pass your girl over to me? What did you just say? I am not his girl and... Well, that works out well. If you just give up that girl you're not into, all our problems will be fixed. Looks like our talk is over. I don't want to see you ever again. Hey, you! What are you going to do? He's totally gonna pick a fight with your crew now. I'll figure something out. If I have to, I'll... <laughs> what the heck are they up to? What's wrong? They got into a small fight. Luckily, it was just some minor injuries. Are you talking about your crew? Yeah, even though I managed to stop them from going once, they went to that high school to have a fight with the other crew. <sighs> Sorry things didn't go well between our crews, even after you took me to the leader from that high school for a discussion. So you're thinking of thanking me, huh? Oh, you want me to give you something back, is that it? Yeah. Let's hang out. This coming weekend. Say what? Come on, it's fine. We're just hanging out. Meet me at the Koiwa Clock Tower at 11 this Saturday. And then Saturday arrived. Hey, sorry I made you wait. It's all good. Is that Kanna for real? Why is she dressed like a girl? Okay, come on, uh, let's go. Hey, where are you going? Come this way. <laughs> uh, my bad. A few minutes later. Come on, ease up a bit. It's really hard to walk when you're clinging on to me like that. I mean, it's just awkward and embarrassing. Aww, chill out. You don't have to hate me that bad. After that, Kanda said she was going to the arcade, so I went with her, but... 
<laughs> Step back a bit. You're too close. This is how it should go. Come on, quit talking and let's get this photo done. Whoa, she smells so nice. After that, we decided to stroll around. Whoa! Shoo, that was a close call. You really shouldn't have worn that. Well, my bad that it doesn't suit me. I never said it didn't suit you. I can't judge how others look when I'm the one looking rough. Uh, I'm actually into your rugged, tough guy side. Hold up, what? What are you even saying? But next time, I want to be in my comfy clothes. Wait, there's a next time? After that, I hung out with Kanna at a bunch of different spots. I was anxious about the clash with the other high school crew, but Kanna reassured me that it would all work out. Actually, the beef between us and the high school crew have stopped. Apparently, Kanna convinced their leader and made them agree to a break for two weeks. It's not surprising he'd go along with what she says. We hung out at the aquarium one weekend. Oh my gosh! The dolphins are so cute! Uh, why is my heart racing? I'm used to her wearing that jacket, right? I should be checking out the dolphins, not her. Quit laughing. That's why I said we shouldn't be in the front row. <laughs> Come on, it's no big deal. You're chuckling along. Jeez. A few hours later. Kanna is taking ages in the toilet. Girls take forever, huh? Oh, is that you, Ryu? Oh, hey, we're in the same class. Ryu, you also come to places like this? Want to explore the aquarium together? Uh, no, actually, I... Really? Oh, the penguins are going for a stroll. Let's go see them. Have fun. You look like you're having a great time. Eek, Kanna! If you want to hang out with them over there, go for it, all right? Huh? What are you saying? Anyways, I'm going to go have a look over there. Hey, wait up! You don't have to come along if you don't want to. We're just hanging out. Not in a relationship or anything. What's she talking about this time? We're grabbing dinner after this, right? Let's go to a fancy restaurant for dinner. Since we're on a date and all. Uh, no stress. We can go somewhere that's not too pricey. Alright. She's confusing me. What's her deal? One hour later. Hey, remember when I was pretty much on my own in class in middle school? Well, yeah, you had blonde hair since then and kept trying to mess with us troublemakers. I really struggled to blend in, and I didn't like hanging out with the whole class. You look like you were in charge, too. But... If you pull this stunt again... Alright, I got it. Chill out. Hey! You, are you seriously being rude to girls now? No, Kanda. You got it wrong. Ryu was... Don't bother telling her. But what about it? Just because she's a girl, I'm supposed to cut her some slack? Do you get a kick out of picking on people who can't fight back? Uh. Quit lying. I don't believe you. Seriously, I'm not lying. Those girls were totally trying to mess with you by wrecking your bag. Why would Ryu be mean to anyone else but you? Why is Ryu even looking out for me? He was probably annoyed with those girls for being sneaky and trying to bully you. They were bothering you when you were just keeping to yourself. Don't let Ryu know I spilled the beans. He made me swear not to tell you. And if he catches wind of it, I'm in deep trouble. Then why did you tell me? Because even though Ryu used to shout at me a bunch, he still looked out for me. Uh? That little punk. He never knows when to keep his mouth shut. Hey! Hands off him, all right? It's on me. But you didn't do anything. I totally went off on you when you were just trying to have my back, right? Forget about it. Come on, let's get out of here. You! Hey, I get it if you don't want to hear this, but I'm sorry for everything up until now. I said forget it. You know, seeing you in high school made me think about how what you said in middle school was totally true. You were still leading your crew, but you were just trying to keep things under control so nobody got hurt, right? I... 
realizing that, I just couldn't help but fall in love with you. <gasps> How awkward would it be if the girl you've been arguing with admitted she had feelings for you? That's why I... I couldn't really tell you. I don't hate you or anything, but... Don't worry about it, Ryu. Today's our last date. What are you suddenly going on about? I enjoyed hanging out with you on our dates. See ya. Why is she acting so weird? The next Monday, Kanna, she was all hyped about us being on a date, but why did she suddenly seem off at the end? Hey, boss! Hmm? What's up? The other high school crew called us, and they said we should stop the beef and fights. They even mentioned writing a truce letter as a way to settle things. What do you mean? The leader of their gang at that high school just said to cool it and stop all the brawling out of nowhere. Hold up, he just said that out of nowhere? Hang on, could it be? Kanna! What do you want? Did you go along with his offer? That jerk who said he was going to make you his girl? What on earth are you blabbering about? I know for sure he and his crew wouldn't back down unless you do that. I have no idea what you're saying. But if he and his crew backed off, then everything's cool, right? Kanna. You didn't want to cause trouble for your pals and your crew, did you? Now move out of the way. Class is starting soon. Uh, I'm pretty sure Kanna won't just go along with that jerk's offer quietly. But looks like I have to go see that jerk leader again, huh? Yo, Ryu! Why are you being so secretive? Huh? I can tell you're hiding something. Did you forget what I told you at the school festival? Why not lean on us or your buds and the crew more? I gotta do this for Kanna. If it's Kay, then... Actually... So, I just let it all out. I shared everything with him. From what went down with Kanna to how I feel about our crew. And how I want out because I'm not into troublemakers. Just everything. <laughs> Wait! You're kidding, right? We can't let a girl put herself in danger just to save us. We gotta act fast and figure out our next move. If we don't want things to get messy, we gotta talk to him. You know where their leader is, right? I'll go with you. Thanks, Kay. So, Kay and I went to see the leader of the other high school crew, but... Where did the rest of your crew go? We ain't looking for a fight. So, you're here to have another chat and sort things out between our gangs. You just never give up, huh? Me and Kay tried to make peace with him. We even said we'd steer clear of downtown, but... Enough chit-chat. I'll go easy on you. Just bring your whole little crew down here. Or are you too scared to handle a little brawl? <laughs> Who do you think you are saying that? We were trying to be nice and humble, but you... Kay, stop it! You should have started with this from the start. Is there no other option for this? Hey, they're not backing down. I never expected you two to be this good at fighting. This is a little treat for all your hard work. <laughs> Enough already! Cut it out! Kanna, if you're freaking out so much, just call the cops. It'll be funny to watch the two of them getting rescued by the cops. You can skip calling them. I'm on the brink of getting kicked out of school for being a troublemaker. I don't want the cops to be involved. <sighs> Yo! Do you hear that noise? Huh? Hey, get back from the door, dudes. What? Boss! Kay! You better prepare for what's coming, you losers! <gasps> Why are they all here? Sorry. It was me who got them to come. I just asked a girl in my class to bring them over for me. Not again. <laughs> if they keep it up, I'm gonna give them a piece of my mind. <laughs> Let's do this, you jerk! And the result is... Ugh, dang it, we lost. Don't even think about coming close to us or our school ever again. <laughs> Who cares? I'll just come back up and... You're not getting away with that, got it? What's the deal with all those clothes piled up in the corner? And the tags are still on them. <laughs> I snapped a bunch of photos of them with my phone. If you do anything strange, you know what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> you! You're always acting without thinking! That's what I was gonna say. I really hope he didn't do anything bad to you. 
I'm all good, no worries. Sorry for making you worry. I'm sorry too. It's my fault. I shouldn't have dragged you into this mess. One hour later. Hey guys, I'm sorry to all of you as well. It's my fault. Is that something you should be worrying about, boss? Hey man, I figured it out. Leading just ain't your thing. It's best if you step away from the crew. What are you guys talking about? Dude, do you really think we're exactly like those jerks we just fought with? Relax, you don't have to look out for us. Why is Kay being so nice? All right, I'll back off from being the leader and cleaning up after your messes. Good, your crew ain't so bad after all, right? Yeah, thanks Kay. All right, well, we're out of here. Be sure to get along with Khan now, right? Wait, what? We're not official or anything. I don't see this lasting very long. Hey, what did you just say? You can't be yelling at me like that. Why did you go join those troublemakers all by yourself knowing you're just a girl? We're not gonna take care of you guys, all right? After that, I found out that the leader of the other crew totally lost it and ended up in trouble with the cops. The rest of them got caught and that delinquent crew over there broke up. After all that drama, Kanna started feeling more comfortable in her class. When we had that showdown with the other crew, Kanna reached out to a girl in her class for help, and that really helped her settle in. The girl Kanna asked for help spread the word, and they all went looking for our whole crew. And as for me, who left my crew... Phew! Your hair looks way better like that! You think so? I don't know why, but the class is starting to include me too. But, I mean, I used to be the boss of my crew, so if Kanna is getting along with her classmates, it's best for her to keep her distance from me. Uh, hey, when are you gonna finally ask me? Huh? Ask you what? So, when are you gonna ask me out on a date again? You're so slow. I'll, uh, think about it. Next time, I'll take you somewhere more fun. <gasps> Hi, it's me, Mel. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too.